The fund has been an, an issue for a long time. We should not let this moment in time to do the right thing affect our decision for something that's been a long-term problem. We should use this as an opportunity to look at how we improve the fund going forward. And I've said that from the beginning. If this bill, which will have a small impact on that fund, stimulates the bigger conversation to have how we make it more solvent going forward and make it better for California's taxpayers, we should seize that opportunity as well. The other thing we shouldn't do is we shouldn't revert to that conversation of, well, why do I pay my fire district fee if the firefighter goes to my neighbor's house, they didn't come to my house? Why should I pay the school bond because I don't have kids in the school? You know, it's the collective benefit of society that we look out for each other, that we take care of each other, that we say we plan for the crisis of that individual. And as been said, the overall impact of this is not going to be significant on the fund, but the individual benefit to that striking worker who has to think about buying food for their family or paying their rent, it's going to have a significant benefit to that person. And I would say it's incumbent upon all of us to provide that benefit because what touches one of us touches all of us. And that's why this bill is needed and I respectfully ask for it.